Coleopters, also known as beetles are the largest order of insects, with over 400,000 known species. They are incredibly diverse and can be found in almost every habitat on Earth. Ground beetles are active during the night, emerging from their daytime hiding places to hunt for prey. They are voracious predators, feeding on a wide range of invertebrates. When threatened, they can emit foul-smelling chemicals. They play a vital role in ecosystems as predators, helping to control populations of potential pests. Violin beetles feed on other small arthropods and sometimes on fungi. They are often associated with decaying wood and participate in the decomposition process by consuming fungal spores and mycelium. When threatened, they can emit defensive chemicals as a deterrent. These chemicals can be noxious or irritating to predators. Stag beetles prefer woodlands with plenty of decaying wood. The larvae of stag beetles develop in decaying wood, feeding on it for several years before pupating and emerging as adults, which rarely eat. Adult stag beetles are primarily active during the warm summer months and are often seen flying or crawling in search of mates. They are nocturnal and are attracted to lights. While stag beetles have impressive-looking mandibles, they are not harmful to humans and do not bite. Adults Dorcas hopii are most active during the warm summer months. They are nocturnal and are attracted to light sources. They do not feed extensively and focus primarily on reproduction during their short adult lifespan. Its conservation status varies across its range. In some areas, habitat loss due to deforestation and urbanization poses a threat to their populations. Like most leuconids, giraffe stag beetles exhibit sexual dimorphism, with males typically having enlarged mandibles and females have smaller mandibles. They spend their days resting in sheltered locations such as tree trunks or underground burrows. At night, they emerge to forage for food, mate, or engage in territorial battles. Males often engage in fierce battles to compete for mates. These battles involve wrestling and using their enlarged mandibles to push or throw opponents. The size and strength of their mandibles are key factors in determining dominance. Females, on the other hand, are typically less aggressive and choose mates based on factors such as size and mandible development. Jewel scarabs are known for their beautiful and iridescent coloration. The elytra of these beetles have a metallic sheen, often exhibiting shades of green or blue. These beetles prefer forested environments with a dense canopy. They are often associated with high elevation habitats and can be found on trees, especially where there is an abundance of leaf litter. They are relatively slow moving and spend much of their time on vegetation, including leaves and branches. Sacred scarab holds great cultural and symbolic significance in ancient Egyptian mythology and symbolism. It was associated with the sun god, Ra, and was considered a symbol of resurrection and the eternal cycle of life. They are known for their fascinating behavior of rolling balls of animal dung. They locate and collect dung, often from herbivorous animals, and shape it into round balls. 
These dung balls serve as food sources and breeding chambers. The beetles then roll the balls away from the dung pile to avoid competition and find a suitable location to bury them. They primarily feed on animal dung, which serves as a valuable source of nutrients. By recycling and burying dung, they play a vital ecological role in nutrient cycling and soil enrichment. Long-armed scarab live inside tree holes in montane forest and are attracted to lights. Males and females show differences in size and structure of the legs with males having elongated fortibii. The pronotum is shiny green and the elytra are usually dark with orange patterning. The common cockchafer is primarily nocturnal, becoming active at dusk. Adult beetles are attracted to artificial lights and may fly around them. They are clumsy flyers and often bump into objects. Male cockchafers are known for their drone flight, which involves hovering and producing a buzzing sound. While the common cockchafer can be considered a pest in certain situations, it also plays a role in nutrient cycling and soil aeration. The larvae, by feeding on plant roots and decaying organic matter, contribute to the decomposition process and soil fertility. Goliath beetle is one of the largest beetles in the world. Males can reach lengths of up to 11 centimeters, while females are slightly smaller. They are primarily arboreal, spending much of their time in trees. They are strong flyers and can cover considerable distances in search of mates and food sources. They are also generally docile and not aggressive towards humans. The European rhinoceros beetle lives on wood, and the large larvae can be found in rotting wood stumps and around sawdust. At the margin of its distribution, the beetle is often found in connection with sawmills and horse racing tracks. The larvae grow in decaying plants feeding on woody debris, generally non-resinous. The adult emerges during the spring, and lives several months until autumn. These beetles do not feed, consuming during the few weeks of adult life reserves accumulated during the larval stages. Centaurus beetle have a robust and bulky body structure. Males are easily identifiable by their horn-like projections on their head and thorax. These beetles are generally docile and not aggressive towards humans. Males may engage in combat with each other using their horn-like projections to establish dominance and mating rights. Males of dynasts bear two long horns, one on the head, and the other on the pronotum, forming a plier, the pronotal horn has reddish seedy on its underside. This pronotal horn is absent in females. Some species have an iridescent coloration to their elytra. Certain species of the genus Dynasts also have the ability to change color. This variation in color is due to a spongy layer below the transparent cuticle. This spongy layer is a network of filamentous strands made up of three-dimensional photonic crystals lying parallel to the cuticle surface. Like other dynast species, the Grant's Hercules beetle undergoes a six-stage life cycle from egg to adult, with three larval instars and a single pupil stage. The time from egg to pupil hatching is estimated to take approximately two years. The pupal stage lasts about 30 days. Adults emerge from the pupal chamber between the months of August through October and typically live between two and four months in the wild. Within their native rainforest habitats, Hercules beetles, which are nocturnal, forage for fruit at night and hide or burrow within the leaf litter during the day. The adults are capable of creating a huffing sound, generated by stridulating their abdomen against their elytra to serve as a warning to predators. It has been observed in wild habitat that male will engage in combat to win possession and mating rights to a female. 
During fights, they attempt to grab and pin their rival between the cephalic and thoracic horns to lift and throw them. The successful male wins mating rights with the female. Elephant beetles are known for their unique and impressive appearance. Males have a pair of large, curved horns on their head, resembling the tusks of an elephant, which give them their common name. Their coloration can vary, but they are typically dark brown with a smooth and shiny exoskeleton. They are primarily nocturnal and spend their time in trees. They are strong flyers and are capable of flying long distances in search of mates and food sources. Adult beetles are most active during the warmer months. Caucasus beetles are characterized by their impressive size and striking appearance. Males have large, curved horns on their head and thorax, resembling the horns of a rhinoceros. The coloration is typically black with a smooth and shiny exoskeleton. As adults, they primarily feed on tree sap, although their mouthparts are not well suited for chewing solid food. Five-horned rhinoceros beetles are primarily arboreal and can be found in trees. They are strong flyers and are capable of flying short distances. Males typically measure around 5 to 7 centimeters in length, while females are slightly smaller, measuring around 4 to 6 centimeters like other beetles, they have a compact and elongated body structure. Rhinoceros beetle is not considered globally threatened or endangered. However, habitat loss due to deforestation and the collection of specimens for the insect trade can impact local populations. Conservation efforts focused on preserving their natural habitat and regulating their trade are important for their long-term survival. Shining ball scarab beetles have a shiny and rounded body shape, resembling a small ball, with a metallic coloration. When they curl up into a ball, these beetles make themselves difficult to grasp for their many predators, such as birds and small mammals. Their coloration, although shiny, provides excellent camouflage in dense vegetation. Genji Firefly is native to Japan and it possesses the ability to produce light through a process called bioluminescence. Adult fireflies emit flashes of light in order to communicate with potential mates and attract them for mating. Its flashing patterns differ between males and females. Males produce rapid, synchronized flashes in specific patterns to attract females. Once a female is interested, she responds with her own unique pattern of flashes, and the mating process begins. They prefer areas with dense vegetation where they can find shelter during the day. Like other fireflies, lightning bug possesses the ability to produce light through bioluminescence. Adult fireflies emit flashes of light to communicate with potential mates and establish their presence. They have an interesting feeding behavior. Some species within the Foturis genus are known to be femmes fatales. They mimic the flashing patterns of other firefly species to attract and prey upon them. They lure unsuspecting males of different firefly species, which they capture and consume. However, most of these don't eat at all. Lady beetles are small-sized beetles with a characteristic round or oval shape with brightly colored bodies with distinctive patterns of spots. 
They are known for their predatory behavior and are considered beneficial insects in many ecosystems. The primary diet of lady beetles consists of soft-bodied insects, particularly aphids, which are plant pests. Lady beetles have a well-known defense mechanism called reflex bleeding. When threatened or disturbed, they release a yellowish or reddish fluid from their leg joints. This fluid contains toxic compounds that serve as a deterrent to predators. Weevils are known for their prominent snouts or rostrums, which are elongated extensions of their heads. At the end of the snout, they possess mandibles that are used for feeding and manipulating food sources. They have significant ecological roles in various ecosystems. The giraffe weevil is known for its distinctive and elongated neck, resembling the neck of a giraffe, which gives it its common name. Their exact feeding habits are not well documented, but as weevils, they are generally known to be herbivores. Male giraffe weevils use their elongated necks during courtship displays to compete for females. They engage in gentle combat, pushing and jousting with their necks. Once a male successfully mates with a female, the female lays a single egg at the base of a host tree. The eggs hatch, and the larvae develop within the tree's wood, feeding on the tree's tissue. Onychoceros albatarsus is a relatively rare species of beetle in the family Cerambicidae. It is remarkable for being the only known beetle that has a venomous sting and the only known arthropod that stings with its antennae. Each antenna ends in a stinger that has evolved to resemble a scorpion's tail and it is connected to a venom gland. The titan beetle is one of the largest beetles, with the largest reliable measured specimen being 17 centimeters in length. The short, Curved and sharp mandibles are known to snap pencils in half and cut into human flesh. Adult titan beetles do not feed, searching instead for mates via pheromones while in flight. The adults defend themselves by hissing and warning and biting, and have sharp spines, as well as strong jaws.